First, let's talk about the command for backward march. The command for backward march is the exact same count structure as forward march and mark time, with the only difference being now your left foot is going behind you instead of in front of you. And it looks like this. Backward march and step. So now let's talk about some key things to remember when we backwards march. First, when we backwards march, our heels can never touch the ground. The entire time we're backwards marching, we're staying on our platforms or the balls of our feet. As you backwards march, keep your legs straight, okay? Knees are not bent, and you're gonna do it as a gliding action across the grass. Also, same as forward march, think of this as pulling yourself backward from your hamstring, okay? It's not just a step back, all right? So we don't wanna just be stepping back like this with our heels on the ground, okay? Think of it as a gliding motion with the balls of your feet. Now, it's very easy for us to want to lean back when we're marching backwards, okay? We don't wanna look like this. Something you can do to keep yourself from leaning backwards is as you're backwards marching, kinda keep the top part of your chest weight slightly forward to counterbalance you wanting to lean back, okay? But just make sure that you're not also leaning forward too much. So this is what a good backwards march should look like. Backward march and glide. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and halt. Now, halting when we backwards march is the exact same command as forward march. It's very, very similar. You're going to still point your toe down on count eight, and you're still gonna bring your left foot backward. Just remember that when you're backward marching, your platforms are already on the ground. You need to make sure you initiate the halt by stopping your body from leaning backward and bringing your feet together into the V. So let's watch that. Halt. Ready. Halt. Point and step. So now that we know how to backwards march, let's practice taking eight steps backward with our halt together. Here we go. Backward march and one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and stop. Your homework is to practice doing your eights and eights exercise with backwards marching. So you're gonna take eight steps back, mark time for eight counts, and continue that until you're ready to halt. So let's practice that together. Start in your horns up position. Backward march, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and mark time. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, last time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and stop. Once you feel comfortable doing your eights and eights exercise without your instrument, Grab your instrument and practice doing your backwards marching with your instrument in the horns up position. Backward march and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and mark time. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and mark time. Three, four, five, six, one more time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and hold. 